Monday gang. Here we go. Three days, three ways, and this is going to be a good one. We are talking about one of the biggest trends that is happening this spring in fashion, and that is 70s. Now, let's not freak out. You can do this without looking like you're wearing a costume. It can look chic and cool. It's taking the best part of the 70s, which is colorful, relaxed, and crazy, powerfully sexy, and adapting it in a way that feels authentic and easy and not over the top. So I've got three great looks to mix and match that'll embrace this trend perfectly. Starting with, no surprise, a fun floral print, yep, and your flare. Now, from the beginning, great little blouse. This is a pullover, has this nice neckline and more of kind of that poet sleeve. Now, the floral here, I think, is what makes it so fun for this trend. It's a little bit of brown, a little bit of orange, a little bit of blush. Those are all really key colors for this trend. Now, I tucked it in to a great pair of kick flares. And notice I said kick flare and not traditional flare. Now, if you are not ready to get on that flare train yet, this is an easy one to try when you've been embracing that straight and you wanna get just a little touch of this trend. This is from Seven, lots of stretch in the sky, this fun button fly, little bit of destruction so it doesn't take itself too seriously, and a raw hem. Ankle length on me, it hits just at my ankle, you're a little bit taller or have longer gams, you're gonna get above that ankle bone. Now, I paired it back to a fabulous shoe. This is a nod to that clog style without going over the top. Crazy, crazy comfortable in this yummy brown suede, which picks up some of the kind of earthy, fun tones in this blouse. And of course, you cannot forget the quintessential accessory piece, your gold hoop. I've got a really fun dress coming up next. Okay, look number two. Another way to interpret that 70s trend, natural, natural fabrics. This is a fabulous example from Rails, a button front spin on the slip dress, shirt dress, kind of combined here. It is a wonderful lightweight linen. So easy, easy to wear. And yes, if it wrinkles, that's okay. It doesn't need to be perfect and crisp. That is definitely not what this is all about. I kept mine a button just a little bit to show off a little bit of leg. It also has this fabulous side slit and adjustable cami straps. Now I'm envisioning this for a fabulous shower or a graduation when it is hot, hot, hot. It's an easy one to slip on. It would also be great with a little jacket over. Now, accessories. I'm gonna keep on that natural trend. I popped on one of my favorite new rings, that little bit of resin, and then a touch of pearl on a bracelet. And these fun shoes, this woven detail in these is so great. Another spin on kind of a sister to a clog with that raffia, and I am headed out the door. I've got one more look coming up, and I promise you this one is all the things. Okay, last but not least, you had to know I was gonna put on a jumpsuit. There is no better way to embrace the 70s than to put on a fabulous, flattering jumpsuit. Now I'm gonna tell you, there is no bigger power piece than a incredibly stretchy, uber flattering jumpsuit. It brings out all the Charlie's Angel vibes in the very best way possible. Now this is from Paige. This is an iteration of that incredible jumpsuit we've been loving. It's actually hanging right here behind me, but this is the Carly. You know that pant, you love it. Same stretchy fabrication as the OG Paige jumpsuit, but done with that amazing Carly waistband and leg from the pant that you love. Cleaner shoulders, so none of that puff sleeve, sexy neckline, Ooh, I just adore this guy. Now, how to accessorize it? Gold. Gold is my favorite material and metal when it comes to embracing the 70s. So I popped on this great little double layer. Fun little easy cigar band, and I am ready to go from a jewelry standpoint, but let's talk about the shoes. Now, we know that that clog is absolutely the way to interpret that 70s trend. This guy from Corky's, A, it's crazy comfortable, B, it's crazy chic. 
Yummy, yummy, gives me a whole bunch of height, which of course elongates those legs and makes you stand just a little bit taller. This guy is coming home with me for sure. So fun and a great way to get on board with this trend that is absolutely shooting through the roof. 70s, who knew? Many of us were born in that decade and now we're embracing it in a fun fashion way. It doesn't have to feel costumey. It doesn't have to feel hard. There are easy, easy ways to do it. I hope this gave you three fun little tips on how to interpret it. Thanks so much everyone and we will see you soon. Take care.